Now, Steve, uh, congrats. You have a a show, a new television show, but the real congratulations uh, is that you had a a baby girl recently. Is that right? Yes. Congratulations, of course, is great news. How's that? I bet it wasn't you. Yeah. (laughs) Your wife. (laughs) Really? (laughs) Unbelievable. Incredible. How's that going? <laughs> I was just seeing how long I could go with this. Yeah, but, not uh, long apparently. It's it's been great. It's been great. It's uh, you know, it's weird ha- having a baby girl. Uh, I started realizing how bad I feel for girls because girls are forced to grow up so quick. Uh, you think about it. What's the first toy a little boy gets? A gun, truck, a bike. What's the first toy a little girl gets? Another little baby girl. Right. <laughs> That's kind of messed up. Like, hey, I'm a baby. I'm having so much fun. Time to grow up, baby. Here's your baby. <laughs> <laughs> I just got here. <laughs> What's that kitchen set for? Get in there. You can learn how to bake cookies. <laughs> Even girls... You got to keep that alive. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of responsibility. You're yeah. right. And, and, and girls grow up so quick, even by the laws of nature. When does a girl technically become a woman? Fifth grade. Remember the one day the teacher comes in, separates a class. Life changes after that day. Teacher comes in. All right, all the girls, follow me. Come on. We've got to have a little conversation. Girls go, what's going on? Is there a rainbow outside? <laughs> Girls come back 20 minutes later, I'm so scared. Because that's scary news. You're a kid, you're on a jungle gym, going down a slide. Next thing you know, you're in a cold class with a teacher. You're gonna be bleeding once a month, pretty much the rest of your life. <laughs> so I'm gonna be bleeding? Oh yeah, from where? Right there. <laughs> Is it gonna hurt? Not you, but everyone around you. <laughs> Boy, I'll tell you, after Dennis Leary's story, I gotta say this. I am horny, you're horny. Well, you know the rest. (laughs) Now, you'd think that becoming a dad... Yes. You'd think that becoming a father would make you more mature. That was... (laughs) But apparently, no. That is not the the case. No, no. I I remember uh, I was holding her one day, and she was just dead asleep. Mm -hmm. Uh, Her name's Olivia, so I I should just preface that. Not that it's, it's important to the story, but her name's Olivia, so I'm, I'm holding her, she's dead asleep, and I, for some reason, I started doing the wrestling thing, the, like the Hulk Hogan thing, when you oh, put the, the arm Hogan up. the thing where you lift it up? Yeah, I was just lifting her arm up, and, she, and it kept dropping. I, I couldn't stop laughing. I was looking at my wife, Jessica, I'm like, check this out. Down for the count, it's a chokehold. And then all of a sudden, the arm stayed up, and then she opened her eyes and looked at me, and I was like, oh my God, this is awesome. And she threw up all over me. 